Just days after Bill O'Reilly was pushed out at Fox News, another host making headlines today after what he said about Ivanka Trump and the microphone. Tonight, he is now explaining himself. Here's ABC's chief business correspondent, Rebecca Jarvis. With Fox News already facing backlash from the allegations over its treatment of women, tonight, a new firestorm over what critics are calling sexually charged comments about the president's daughter. I don't really get what's going on here, but uh, I really liked how she was speaking into that microphone. Host Jesse Waters talking about Ivanka Trump on stage in Germany. Today, taking to Twitter to explain what he says he really meant. On air, I was referring to Ivanka's voice and how it resonates like a smooth jazz radio DJ. This was in no way a joke about anything else. Today, the White House saying it has no comment about Waters' remarks. But tonight, Fox is facing more lawsuits. And welcome to America's News Headquarters. Anchor Kelly Wright coming forward to join a class action suit, accusing Fox News of hostile racial discrimination and plantation-style management. I want to make it possible for whoever fills my shoes, that next generation, to never go through this. Wright, who says he was demeaned and passed over for promotions, compelled to speak out after fellow employees shared stories of alleged racial humiliation. Like Tabrice Wright from Payroll, who told George Stephanopoulos how former VP Judith Slater spoke to her. She's like, oh, you have children. I'm like, I have three, all by the same man. And I'm like, yes, I was shocked. I was shocked. David, tonight a lawyer for Judith Slater is calling the charges frivolous, aimed at inflaming racial tensions. Meantime, Fox News vehemently denies the race discrimination claims. David? Rebecca, thank you.